Hi there. So, Christmas, the most awaited time of the year. Am I right? Most of the fondest memories I have as a kid are about Christmas. And no, it's not about building a Christmas tree or hanging up Christmas stockings or whatsoever. Christmas is about getting new clothes and showing them off. Oh. Oh. You know what I mean? <laughs> well, let me explain. Basically, I did not grow up in a well-off family, so I didn't have the luxury to buy new clothes as often as I wanted. So I would wear the same set of clothing all week, all year, and the only time I get to buy new clothes is if it's Christmas. Ho oh, ho oh, ho! Oh. As soon as December steps in and my dad receives his salary bonus, my mom would take me and my siblings to the mall and we would shop for new shirts, new pants, and if there's extra money, new shoes. I don't know about you, but it always makes me feel good and confident in a way whenever I wear new stuff. Damn! New shirt? New shoes? You must be rich! But I really wasn't. I know, when you have new clothes, you will feel excited to wear them right away and show them off to your classmates and friends, but no matter what you do, do not wear them until the day of the Christmas party. Don't be that kid where everyone else is wearing new clothes and you are not. You'll be like, oh, didn't you just wear that last week? But one of the traumatic things I experienced with school parties is the exchange gifts. One time, I asked my mom to buy a Transformer toy figure for my secret Santa. That thing was expensive. I had to convince my mom that that's what my teacher told us to do, so... I mean, she was reluctant, but she ended up buying it for me anyway. So, at the party, I was very excited to give my gift to my secret Santa, and I wanted to see his reaction. He opened the gift and his eyes were just full of surprise and it's probably the nicest gift he received probably ever. So that was nice. When it was my turn to open my gift, I guess I was hoping that I would receive the same thing or something better. Besides, the more you give the more you receive, right? Well, I guess not all the time. I opened my gift and what I was expecting to be an awesome toy or whatever. I got a bar of soap. I almost cried at that time, but what else can I do, right? So moral lesson of the story I guess is don't stress yourself in buying Christmas gifts. Everything gets old and you never know if the gift you're going to give the person will mean anything to them. You know, they may just throw it away or give it to somebody else or chew it by their dog or whatever. Anyway, I just want to give my special thank you to Miss Lauren of L Cartoons for reading a few lines on this video. That was really awesome. You folks better check her channel because she is super cool. And oh, Merry Christmas guys and Happy New Year. That's it. Bye. Peace.